Hey guys, just coming on, spend some time with you guys really quickly before I head off to bed. Um, I'm just up, I'm just up, just got done putting my roller set in, up working. I had a really long day today. I actually um, had a vendor event today. I also did six virtual parties. Hi mom, Connie, hi ma, Connie five, welcome. I actually did like six uh, virtual parties. So I've been busy, but you know, I wanted to share a quick story. Um, hi, hi, how are you? I noticed you by your picture. Hi, Bama girl, 17, where you been? Welcome. I haven't seen you in a while. Where have you been? Yes. How I'm doing good, tired, but I'm doing good and I'm just feeling blessed and stuff. Yeah, guys. So um, really quickly, if you could please, sh at work, yeah, I can imagine. I haven't seen you in a while. <laughs> I hope everything's going well. I hope work is well. Yes, many blessings to you. So um, if you um, guys coming on in, just please share the broadcast uh, for someone who you will think will um, gain a lot from this information. Good, good. Um, those of you who don't know me, my name is Letitia Campbell, and I help bring sweet aromas into women's homes and show them how to live financially free while doing it. Thank you guys so much for sharing with your followers. Thank you, Hassa, for joining. Thank you, Martin. Hi, Ma Hi, Miss Karen. How are you? Wow. You guys up late with me. I love it. Thank you guys so much for the hearts. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. So, yeah. So, um, hi. So, yeah, I just want to tell you guys a quick story um, because, as you guys know, my husband and I went on, like, a little mini vacation last week. And we actually pretty much overspent. Like, we always go on our trips. Hi, welcome, Rings for. We also always go on our trips with some type of budget. But, you know, um, we always end up overspending. So, hi, how are you? Welcome, good night. Yes. Um, if you guys haven't shared the scope, please share the scope. And so, yeah, so we basically overspent. And so we were kind of in a rut or whatever, because, you know, we do have three children, you know, but we do like to go out and still have couple time. Because if you're married, I think it's important for you to spend time with your husband, uh, <clears throat> alone time outside of the kids, you know, because I just think that it's just super duper important. But yeah, so we, um, let me get my cell phone stand. We basically overspent, but you know, what's so crazy about me having my business is that, um, I do have the luxury of getting that additional paycheck every month because I do have my own business. So this is sort of like a mini Q&A for you guys who have questions because, you know, every month is an awesome month to um, start your own Cincy business. But this month is particularly special because this is our transition month, which means that um, we're transitioning from the fall winter. I'm sorry, from the summertime to the fall season meaning that if we, once you do join you're actually going to get double size of your kit you're going to get a um a double triple size of your kit which means that you're going to get two kits for the price of one and what I tell a lot of my girls though especially those of you who have been contacting me on Periscope those of you guys who watch me all the time thank you so much and also a uh, quick shout out to my replayers thank you thank you thank you um so for those of you guys who have questions about the price of the kit and things like that, I always tell my potential recruits that the price you pay for your kit is considered a tax write-off. Thank you guys that for those green hearts. Thank you. So you can, are going to actually end up getting back the price that you invested in your kit um, back once you file for your taxes. Because as you guys know, once you click that join button, and you become, you're considered an entrepreneur, you, you're considered a business owner. So anything that you invest in your business, you get back. You can put it as a tax write-off. Yes. So if you guys haven't already shared the broadcast, please share it to someone that you think that will benefit from this information. Someone who you think that will, that wants to earn extra money every single month, whether it be part-time or full-time. Definitely, definitely share. Hi, Mambua. Welcome to the scope. Welcome. Yes. And please continue to tap, tap, tap that screen. So yeah. Oh, uh, so true about the tax write. Yes, yeah, it's, it's an absolute tax write-off. Um, last year when I filed for my taxes, I was actually surprised because my tax preparer told me that um, I could have brought in like receipts and expenses from items that I paid for that I didn't know that I could actually put as a write-off. So I lost out on some money because I didn't actually like had different purchases that I made for my business throughout the year, but I didn't save the receipts from it. So 
again, you need proof to show. But again, I realized that this year. So once I filed for my taxes for uh, 2016, I'm, I'm way prepared right now. I'm so prepared. It's, it's, it's crazy. So I'd say that because I don't want people to think like, OK, first of all, it's only ninety nine dollars to pay for your kit. You can't tell me you don't have ninety nine dollars. Like, come on. You know, ninety nine dollars could you could be you not eating out for the entire month of August. Ninety nine dollars could be you not purchasing that pair of shoes that you really don't need. You know, you could always find a way like if you had to pay extra ninety nine dollars for your light bill, you will definitely find a way to 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 come up with that money I mean so for people to say oh I don't have it or whatever that's really just an excuse and that's just you really be procrastinative and just lying to yourself so yeah guys let me just reset myself my name is Letitia Campbell and I'm your home fragrance specialist I help bring sweet aromas into women's homes and show them how to live financially free while doing it if ever you guys need to connect with me I have all my contact information in my bio so you just swipe up and, um, yeah, my phone number's there and my website is there. So if you ever need to connect with me, you know, there are apps that track your expenses, make it easy. Yes, there's apps as well. Yes, yes. There's definitely apps that helps you track your expenses, which is awesome. Um, it's important as a business person to always track what money that you're investing in your business. Because, again, once you go to file for your taxes, like Ms. Karen said, all that information you're going to use as a tax write-off. Billionaires do this every single year. Billionaires always track their expenses and make sure that they're being written off for all the expenses. My, um, I actually work full time. The owner of my company, every time we go out for these little luncheons or whatever, all that he writes off as taxes, right? Also, like, let's say like sometimes like he'll like take everybody out for drinks or something like for the holiday or something like that. And he always says, Letitia, because I'm the one who handles all of his um, accounts and stuff. So I always have to like track his purchases and make sure that all the receipts match up and things like that. And all of that, like literally, um, when was it? Last month, we had a going away party for one of our um, one of our um, directors that was uh, resigning. And she's been with the company for a long time. So the agency had a special party for a going away party. And I kid you not, the bar tab, like literally when the, when the owner of our company, whenever he comes into the room, like we all know we don't have to pay for our food, like, cause he shuts it down. So he comes in, he opens the tab, the bar tab, and literally towards the end of the bar tab, the bill was over $1,600. So guess who ended up taking the receipt? I did. Well, I didn't pay for it. Cause I would be like, uh, bye bye. <laughs> Bye, boy, bye. bye. <laughs> They've been washing dishes, cleaning floors, uh, 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 wiping down windows if I had to pay that bill. Because I'd be like, oh, no. <laughs> but, yeah, I had to take the receipt because then I have to file it and, you know, do all the stuff with that. So, yeah, that's how I definitely knew how much the bill was. But, again, I say that because th every, every business owner does that. They take any expense or investments that they put into their company and then once they file for taxes for the year coming, they put that down as a business expense. Because, um, you know, there's, there's tons of ways of tax write-offs you can get. You, like what um, Karen said, if you're dropping off a delivery to someone, the gas mileage is considered a tax write-off. If you are, again, joining my team and you're paying for your starter kit, that's considered a tax write-off. There's multiple things that you can write off if you're buying business supplies for your business. That's a tax write-off. If you are happen to mail out a catalog to somebody, that's a tax write-off. I mean, again, guys, not even just trying to get into the tax, tax write-off. What I'm really trying to get you guys to understand is that if you want a better life for yourself, if you want a better quality of life for your family, if you want to bring in that extra income for your household, you should be joining my team. Because I was just had a conversation with a young lady the other day who contacted me through Periscope. And she was the first question she asked me. She was like, I don't know how to sell. I don't really know a lot of people. I was like, well, you should definitely join because I don't sell. <laughs> I don't sell to anybody. Anybody who had, thank you for the green hearts. Everyone who has um, contacted me, contacted me just for me sharing. I'm sharing, like, just like I'm sharing the opportunity with you guys. Just like I share my products with everyone else. 
I, that's not me selling. I'm just sharing what I love. I use the product in my house every single day. And I'm also a business owner myself. So I'm just sharing my experience with you guys and sharing my tips and sharing the things that I know. I don't have to be, I don't beat down nobody's doors. I don't send uh, a thousand individual emails every single day trying to get somebody to join my team or purchase my product. I just share. I share a photo on my social media. I will uh, um, have one of my um, scent rollers on and somebody will smell and say, oh my God, that's awesome. I will warm one of my warmers at work. I would do a little video talking about how to use my diffusers. All that is sharing. It's sharing. I'm not pitching no pitch to anyone because when, once people get the products in their hand, that it just goes from there. And again, everyone wants their home to smell good. My company is very different from most companies because it's not one dimensional. My company is not one dimensional at all because normally if you're selling makeup, or if you're selling a weight loss product, all those are just basically one dimensional. If a person doesn't want to lose weight, they're going to say, oh, I don't want to lose weight. Uh, hi, welcome. Uh, if a person is not a huge makeup person, they're like, oh, I don't want to wear makeup. But, um, oh, yeah. Oh, God, I got to set yours up. Let me write that down. I'm so sorry, Karen. Yes, I'm going to set that up for you. You know, but with, with my product, um, it's it's... Every, it serves everyone because everyone wants their home to smell good. Let me get you out of here, boo boo. Why do people put those little, those little things up? I don't know what those mean, but anyway, I rebuke you in the name of Jesus. <laughs> and let me just reset myself on that note. Again, guys, my name is Letitia Campbell and I'm your home fragrance specialist. I help bring sweet aromas into women's homes and show them how to live financially free while doing it. If ever you guys need to contact me, swipe on up. My website is there. My phone number is there. You can call or text me if you have any questions. And yes, that is me. Once you contact me, that is actually me. <laughs> Someone called me and said, oh my God, I didn't think it would be you. Yes, yeah, me. <laughs> so you guys can feel free to contact me anytime. I love your questions and stuff like that because I had tons of questions before I started launching my business as well. So I know you will also. So yeah, um, like I was saying, it's like, you know, my product serves everyone. It serves everyone because again, everyone wants their home to smell good. Everyone wants their laundry to smell good. Everyone wants their bodies to smell good. So it's, it, it, it's for everybody. It's for men. It's for women. It's for everybody. So you don't have to worry about trying to uh, sell your product because everyone loves you. It's going to love it. So I never worried about that, you know, and I never worried about trying to build a customer base because it's something that's just going to gradually happen if you are excited about what you sell. And again, guys, going back to why August is an amazing month, uh, one of the first reasons why August is high, one of the first reasons why August is an amazing month to join my team. Hold on, let me check this is a troll. Okay, you don't have a bio, boo-boo. So when if I see your name back up, I'm going to block you. Sorry. I have a bio. Come on. Um, <laughs> yeah. So um, the first reasons why reason why it's a great time to join my team. Guys, please continue to tap, tap, tap that screen. Yes. I love to see those hearts. Uh, the first reason is because, again, it's transition month. So you're actually going to get um, two kits for the price of one. Okay. So in your kit, you're going to get all your testers all your catalogs, you're going to get warmers, you're going to get um, all kinds of stuff. Let me see if I have a photo of the kit actually to show you guys. Hold on, let me move this around. Ugh. Hi, welcome whoever joined. I'm sorry I missed your name. So I'm going to turn my screen around really quickly to show you guys how the kit looks. And I wish when I joined, I had took a picture of my kit, but I was so excited that I just popped it open. So this is the, um, this is the basic kit that you'll receive for $99. And you're going to have your catalogs. You're going to have your, um, consultant guide. You're going to have our laundry care product, which all these items here is from our laundry care line. You're going to have items from our skin line. You're going to get some Scentsy bars. You're going to get all your testers. These little tower thing here is testers. You're going to get a warmer, a full-size warmer, okay? So you can actually have a launch party once you get your kit. You're going to get some display brochures, which, like, if you're having, like, a launch party, these brochures can be used for people to just look at, get a full glance of your items. You're going to get some party invites. Um, you're also going to get a car bar, and 
good uh what i forgot what this tube is i'm sorry some lotion products you're going to get a bunch of stuff but if you join this month you're actually going to get two a uh, two sets of that so you're actually going to get two full kits okay because the reason why we are supply you with the second kit because as you know next month is, the, is september so it's considered the spring summer season i'm uh, sorry it's considered the fall winter season so you're going to get um your catalogs for the fall winter season you're going to get your testers your transition testers for the fall winter season hi baba can welcome um let me check your bio real quickly sweetie okay i'm a block you sorry sorry bub your bio doesn't make no sense to me <laughs> my block game is on point this month yes if you guys haven't shared the scope, please, please share the scope. And if you're not following me, please make sure to follow me. I would so appreciate that. Yeah, so um, you're going to get two kits, basically. Yes. <laughs> yeah, it's on point today, Karen. I'm not playing. I'm not playing. I, I don't go for the numbers. Like, when I scope, I don't be like, oh, my God, I got to have 50 people watching me. I really go for the quality of the people who come in. So, yeah, there's days where I do screen the people that come in. If your bio looks kind of funny, i just rather block you right then and there rather than you saying something silly because it's too late to deal with the nonsense. <laughs> so, I do screen the people that come into my broadcast. That's just what I do. Yeah, so you're going to get two kits, two large kits. You're going to get your catalogs, your transition testers, all that. Thank you. All that um, in addition to your regular basic kit. All right? Hi, Delona Morgan. Welcome. Oh, I love your uh, profile, Delona. Yes, I'm going to follow you. You have been followed. <laughs> and um, I hope I pronounced your name right, Delona. If you're new to my scope, let me just reset myself and introduce myself to you. Welcome. My name is Letitia Campbell, and I'm your home fragrance specialist. I help bring sweet aromas into women's homes and also show them how to live financially free while doing it. So if ever you need to contact me, definitely go to my website at bit.ly forward slash remove that odor. You can actually swipe up. My website is right there on my bio along with my phone number. And today I'm talking about um, telling you guys reasons why you should definitely think about joining my team because August is an amazing... You're welcome, Mama. August is just an amazing um, month to just start a business because... This month, the second reason why you should join my team, I'm glad you came in, Delona, De because you just helped me um, remember my second reason. The second reason why you should join my team in August is because right now, 90% of our websites is on sale. 90% of our products is on sale. I'm talking about our diffusers. I'm talking about our warmers. I'm talking about our, our Scentsy bars. I am talking about practically mo almost everything except for our campus warmers. Outside of that, everything else is on sale. So you're starting your business with people. You, when you're introducing your business to people, you're starting off giving them a discounted price. Now, that is awesome. So that's why Transition Month is always a time where I get more people added to my team. Thank you guys for the heart. If you're not following me, please make sure you guys follow me so you get all my notifications. August since that expired is the business. No, my, the, oh, I think you've been part of my post before. Yes. My business, um, my brand name is called Since That Inspired. That's my brand name, okay? The, I, but I sell Scentsy products, okay? So are you familiar at all with Scentsy products? If you have a question, just let me know. Hi, darling. Did you um, get my, my answer? I'm sorry. I'm not sure if you got my answer. I saw that you left and you came back in. Yeah, so my brand is Since That Inspired. That's what my uh, website is called and everything is Since That Inspired. That's my brand. But I sell Scentsy products. So, um, yeah, I try to brand myself because there's other things, other businesses that I get into as well. But, yeah, guys, I let me just reset myself real quick. Again, guys, my name is Letitia Campbell, and I bring sweet aromas into women's homes and also show them how to live financially free while doing it. I am, I have a horrible, oh, I'm sorry. Yes, I'm sorry. Some days, it's not even just a connection. Some days, Periscope just acts crazy. So yeah, the second reason why you should join my team this month is because again, you're launching your business, but you're launching your business with all of your product line, most of your product line at a discounted price. So if when you give that person that first catalog, you could already tell them, listen, make sure you pick now what you want because after this month, it's going to go back up to regular price. So you're offering people um, your products on sale and that's awesome. People are going to go crazy for it because you're going to have your testers. 
You're going to have your catalog. You're going to have your warmers. You're going to have even your laundry care products and your skin products to actually show off what you have to offer. And then you're also offering it all at a discounted price. And they're going to absolutely love it. So I always get more recruits this month because people love starting their business off with everything on sale. I don't have that. Okay, so let me go into that. <laughs> let me go into that. Now, I hear that a lot that people say they don't have time. They don't have time. You know one of the biggest mistakes we do as women? We spend more time investing in helping someone else accomplish their dreams and helping somebody else get rich and helping somebody else put their children through college and helping somebody else get the, themselves out of debt. Then we spend more on time on ourselves. Okay, so saying that you don't have time is just an excuse. I'm sorry. I have three kids. I have a nine-year-old son, a six-year-old daughter, and a three-year-old son. Okay, I also work full-time. Okay, and when I first started my business, I was going to school online. All right, so I had no time for nothing extra. Literally, I go to work. I, I woke up at four o'clock in the morning just to study. OK, and then I came home to have to help my children with their homework. And one of my my, my oldest son, he is um, he has a learning disability. OK, so I spend two hours still to this day helping him out with his homework. OK, and then I have to help my daughter out with her homework as well. So and then I have to come after doing all that. I have to make sure to do my homework to um, get my homework submitted online because I went to school. I did my schooling online. OK, because I couldn't like go to, to go to a campus or anything like that. So I made time for my business. I made time, whichever way, outside connection boosts your business. Use the outside connection. Yeah, you can use, yes, thank you, Karen. I made time for my business because I sat down one day at work and I said, you know what, I'm putting all my talents, I'm putting all my skills, I'm putting all my abilities into helping my boss get a brand new car every year, to helping my boss get a brand new war wardrobe every year. To help my boss take vacations to Hawaii and take take all this stuff. And I'm like, okay, what am I doing for myself? You know what I mean? I barely got a raise. My insurance is crappy still to this day. I still got to pay deductible out the wazoo, okay? And I'm paying what? What was it? Family right now, I pay like almost $400 a month for, a med for medical insurance. And I'm still paying... $50 copays, $30 copays. I went to the emergency room about this figure the, like a couple of months ago and I had to wear, pay a $300 copay. Like, hello? I really like that you offer it. Yes, uh, yes, yes, there you go. You, you know, and I don't have time. I don't have time to do home parties, okay? And my, my business is the home party business. I don't even have time to do home parties, but guess what? Just like Karen says, I do virtual Facebook parties. I find a way to make time for my business. So I get what you're saying that you don't have time or what have you, but that's just an excuse because you'll make time for your boss. You'll make time to wake up every morning to go to your job. You make time to do all that, but you don't, you don't want to make time for yourself. So that's just an excuse and that's just a huge setback and I don't mean to be mean or harsh, but I say that to everyone who tells me the reason why they can't join my team is because they don't have time because that's, that, that is the biggest lie that you could tell yourself in a whole entire universe. The biggest lie. If your boss told you, listen, uh, Samantha, you have to stay an extra two hours um, for work today because we need this report done, you'll do it. But saying that, okay, yeah, it's fear. It's totally fear. Yeah, it's totally fear, Mo uh, Morgan. It's totally fear. And us women are the only people who think that way. My husband, I, t I tell you, men are way different than we are. Way different than we are. My husband... He started out, we both started out working in, well, I started out working in retail before he did. Way before he started getting into retail, I was. And in a short amount of time, he made triple what I made. And you know why? It's because he acts, okay? And he, and he, he puts a value on his worth. And we have a huge issue as women doing that. We don't like to act, we don't like to make time, and we don't like to put a value on our worth. And that, that, that is what really demolishes us. And the thing is about my husband, and this is about men in general, because my dad was this way, every man in my family is this way. They don't mind collaborating with people. They don't mind. A man would never look at another man and think, oh, he's a threat. You know, they'll never, what they'll do is like, okay, you know what they would do? And I see my husband do this with my own eyes. I see my dad even, rest in peace, did, did do this with his own eyes. 
if he's if he if they see someone who is doing something better than them or or has something that they feel that they need they don't mind linking up with that person and instead of them getting offended at that person they find you yes instead of get, getting jealous or offended by that person they don't mind linking up with that person to gain the knowledge that they have they don't mind doing collaborations you understand so but us women we have a huge problem with that we have a huge problem with that so in most cases you know yeah it's about domination yes yes morgan you said it it's about domination with them they men just want to go in and just take over like my husband wants to walk in a room and he just wants to change the atmosphere and just takes over that room and that's what he thinks like men are not, uh, women are more you know we reserve back we want to stand the corner and just see what everyone else is doing and then we go in no my husband's solely different when it comes to that so you know, when I when I approach women sometimes, hi guys, I see some people coming in, so let me just reset myself. Welcome everyone, all my new newbies. I know it's a lot of you guys are new. Uh, my name is Letitia Campbell and I'm your home fragrance specialist. I help bring sweet aromas into women's homes and also show them how to live financially free while doing it. If ever you guys need to contact me, um, definitely go swipe up. Okay, you're, who is this, Prince? I gotta block you, boo boo. Sorry, you walked into the wrong room because it's bigger. This figure right here is blah, blah, blah. Okay. <laughs> it's too late for the games. What? It's about to be 12 a.m. and I'm not for it. Maybe in the morning you can get me. <laughs> you did? <laughs> I was like, wait a second. <laughs> See, when a lot of people come in at once, I, I'm kind of slow with my blocking, but I get them. I get them, right? <laughs> yes. So, you know. Men like to dominate. Women, we don't like to dominate all the time. So I find it that I spent more time supporting my husband and his goals and his dreams. And I still do that to this day. I will always support him because we're, we're married. And that, that's what I'm supposed to do as a wife. But I had to sit back one day and think about... I'm sorry, let me block this person. Sorry, baby, block. I had to sit back one day and think about what are my dreams are? What are my goals are? I'm sitting here helping my husband out with all his goals, all these ideas he has in his head. I'm like, okay, babe, we're going to do this, this, that. We're going to get it cracking. We're going to get it going. And then when it comes to myself, I'm like, oh, I'm just like that, like that girl who made that comment about I don't have time. I don't have time. And I really had to sit down. And one day I just got on my computer. I looked at different companies and I said, you know what? I like this company and I just joined. I mean, obviously before that, I asked different questions. I linked up with and collaborated with some consultants and, you know, get, got their advice on it, on, on what they do to manage and run their business and things like that. And once it came my time to join, I absolutely took advantage of it. And I actually joined. Um, you see that, Karen? You see that? Three people in like three seconds. Awesome. <laughs> I, oh, it was it was a perfect time for me to join because I joined in an incentive month and I ended up earning all these um, different awards, which was very easy and simple for me. And, and it will definitely be for you as well. And so um, I actually earned like three kits in one month, <laughs> which was awesome. So um, it was just a perfect time for me to join. And so I had to take that leap and just say yes to having an abundant future. I had to say yes to wanting more in my life. I had to say yes to wanting more for my children. And I joined and I never looked back. I swear to God, I never looked back. I just kept going, going, going in my business. And to be honest with you, when I first started my business, my husband wasn't 100% behind me. And you know what's so funny about that, guys? Let's do a little woman chat real quick because I know at least three of you guys feel me on this okay i spent years my, my husband and i've been married for 14 years okay if you want to see a picture this is him that's my hubby that's my hubby yes we've been married for 14 years and let me tell you something i was always team my husband all the time anything he wanted to do even if it was an idea that i was like you know what i don't know if that's going to work out but i didn't care being the fact that he was so passionate about an idea i just went through it and supported him but then when it came time for me, when I was like, okay, I want to launch my own business and this is what I'm doing, babe. I pay for my kit. I'm, I'm about to do this. You know, he was like, why do you want to do that? You know, and I got angry. I got so bad because I didn't get mad at the whole hesitation of him because I get it that certain people in your family or your friends, they're going to be hesitant about your business because they don't get your purpose. Only you're going to get your purpose. Nobody else is going to get your purpose but you. 
But I was upset. I was like, listen, I spent all this time supporting you. You better support me. So, yeah, it took him some time. But the thing about my husband, I know this is about, I know this is the same for most of you guys, uh, significant others in your life. Men are, on top of them, being dominating about their business. Hold on one second. Hello? Hello? Hi, Leticia. Good night. Hi, good night. Uh, we're in a taxi coming, so we should be there like in 10 minutes. Awesome. Thank you. Okay, no problem. Bye-bye. What, Stacey, you're serious? Hi, can you guys hear me? I'm sorry. I just took a call. Can you guys see me? Hit one if you can see me. Hit one if you can see me and hear me. Awesome. Hold on. Let me check who this is. Let me check who entered the room. Okay. Hi, Johnson. Welcome. Okay, Johnson looks cool. We're going to keep Johnson. I'm sorry, Johnson. I'm I'm screening everyone who's coming in. And your picture looks pretty decent. Okay, Jiggy stepped on in. Hi, how are you? Yeah, I'm just screening everyone that comes in the room because it's too late for the trolls. So yeah, so I um, like I was just saying, like I was always behind my husband in his dreams. So when it came time for me to do something, he was sort of hesitant. So the second thing about men, I know I told you guys about the first thing about how men are very dominating and they don't mind collaborating with people. They're not threatened by another man. They just do it, um, and they just excel. But for us, right? Also, in addition with men, the second thing about men is that you got to show the results. Like, I could tell my husband all day, like, oh, my God, my business is booming. My business is awesome. My business is doing great. I could tell him that all day, every day. Right. But well, really what he's looking at is the bank account. OK, that is really like putting like really like words behind what I'm saying. So only when he saw that I was like not only making an income from my business. But I was paying bills. I was going on girls weekend trips. I was paying for our little mini uh, vacation trips. Yeah, they need to see results. So once I figured that part out and he actually started seeing results that, okay, I'm making income. I'm not sitting here asking him for like pocket money, you know. You know how his wife's like, like, babe, can I please ask for pocket money? Like we like to get them before payday, you know. Give him that special something, something before payday. And then the next morning, you're like, hi, honey, do you have like $40, huh? That, I don't even say, can I borrow? Because I literally put in work the day before. I'm not borrowing nothing from him. But I'm like, can I get $40? And then you get it. And so he noticed that I don't ask for that no more. I haven't asked for that in what? <laughs> you know what I mean, Karen, okay? <laughs> this is a grown woman's scope. Um... Well, he knows that I stopped, you know, having my hand out every uh, Friday morning or every, well, he got paid by weekly every other Friday morning. <laughs> he was like, okay, what's going on? So, yeah, so um, that's one of the, per the one thing you have to show your spouse as well is the results. So you could talk all day long saying how your business is successful is going to be awesome. But they have to see, men have to see results. So once he saw the results, and also once he saw how passionate and consistent I was about my business, he automatically jumped on board. He automatically jumped on board. And um, helped me determine my full-time job quick date. So, yeah, that's what it was with that. So, you know, guys, um, at the end of the day, it's more about what... Where do you value your worth to be? If what you're getting at your full-time job right now, if you feel that that's all you can make or that's all the potential or worth that you have, then, hey, stay there. I mean, um, if you're happy and you feel that um, you can't do nothing more, okay, I'm sorry, uh, Cirk, S-E-R-K, but you look creepy, boo-boo. Sorry. Yeah, so... <laughs> <laughs> you need like I don't even get to say anything. Sorry, you know I think it's very important. If you guys are going to be on Periscope. Um, get a bio, get a bio, and get a decent picture because I'm sorry, there's tons of trolls, especially in late night. There's tons of trolls out there, so it would be helpful if you guys get a cool bio and you know a decent picture. 
<laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying, okay? <laughs> I don't want to deal with the trolls today. So, yeah, uh, thank you guys for the heart. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hey, guys, remember, if you're not following me, please make sure you follow me. If you also think this content is going to be uh, important for somebody, please share it, too. That's a whole nother. Uh, that's a whole level school troll. Yeah! School troll. Patrol. Yes. So, yeah. Um, really, it's about what you feel that you're worth. You know, at the end of the day. And I definitely started to put a price on my worth. And I and once I put a price on it, I realized that my there's no way my job is going to be able to match that price. There's no way. So, that's when another reason why I started launching my business because I realized what my worth is and on top of that I wanted more for my children I wanted more for my family and I wanted more for myself and I like having that luxury to be able to like for example I went on vacation last week with my husband and you know we overspent but then I was like you know what I'm getting paid like on Monday so it's nothing so <laughs> So that's just the awesome part of just about having a business. And when you do join, right? Hi, Marcia. Welcome. Hi, Miss Shannon. How are you today? Um, so when you do, um, yes, it's, it's easy. It, it, it just takes a lot of stress off. And when you do join my team, it's like, hi. When you do join my team, you're going to get a ton of support. I mean, a ton. I'm following you now, Miss Shannon. Okay, I'm following you. You are now followed. <laughs> uh, when you do join my team, you're going to get a ton of ton of support because I am a huge uh, coach to my team. I coach them. I mentor them. I don't make them feel like they're by themselves in their businesses. Um, the thing about thank you for sharing with your followers, Miss Shannon. Uh, the thing about a lot of times with different sponsors um, is that they sort of sign you up and then they're gone. I don't do that. I have weekly trainings with my team. I have one-on-one -on -one trainings with my team. I always try to make a note. And when, then when I notice that I um, I miss or somebody missed their one-on-one -on -one with me, because my one-on-ones are all virtual, so I have Zoom. So all you got to do is download, download Zoom onto your phone, and we can, like, see each other and talk. Because sometimes people need that one-on-one -on -one attention, you know, and then I find it when I have my team meeting, because that's virtual as well, that sometimes you get some of those consultants that are just shy, they don't want to ask the question, or they may think that the question is silly, or whatever so I like to do a one-on-one -on -one because I find that a lot of times they ask way more questions and they may way more engaging when I do a one-on-one -on -one with them but yeah so um I'm not one of those sponsors that leave you aside and this month now is a brand new incentive month so you have the opportunity actually to earn a trip to Puerto Rico yeah virtual, yeah, virtual I do those all the time and I actually like those those are awesome because I actually sit down and I take notes like if we were to do a one-on-one, -on -one, I take notes. So then when we do another one the following week, I automatically know where we left off. Like if you needed help with booking Facebook parties and I trained you and talked about you with that, the following week when we have our another one-on-one, -on -one, I'll ask you, okay, how's it going? Do you need more tips? Do you need me to actually come in along with you to, uh, with a Facebook party to actually help you to engage more? Like I had uh, my last team training with one of my teammates. She wanted help with scoping. So, um, hold on one second. Somebody's ringing the doorbell. Oh, she needed help with scoping. So we actually, um, I gave her some tips about that. And so now when I speak to her tomorrow, I'm going to ask her how she, well, I actually see how she's doing with scoping because I always, um, I'm subscribed with her. But um, I'll ask her like some questions about that. So I'm going to head off, guys. And remember, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact me. Just swipe up. All my information is right there. I thank you. Thank you so, guys, so much, guys, for joining me tonight. I know it's one of my late scopes, but thank you so much. So I catch you guys tomorrow. I'm going to be back on tomorrow morning. This person is ringing my doorbell. I'm going to be on tomorrow morning at 6 o'clock in the morning. All right, guys. Catch you then. Bye.